Today, Michelle and I are visiting one of the most beautiful places in Poplar. It's become beautiful. They've made it uh, into quite a nice park, but it was a little unfinished before the um, lockdown came. And as a result, the flower beds have become full of these extraordinary weeds, poppies, cornflowers, daisies, yellow daisies, purple flowers, absolutely amazing. As we see the wind blowing through, this a mass of colour. It reminds us again of Pentecost. Michel has brought to us a reading from Matthew, the teaching of Jesus on the Mount. He said, don't worry about clothes. Don't worry about the ordinary things of life. They'll be sorted. Solomon, in all his glory, couldn't outshine these beautiful flowers. And these are here as weeds. Our other reading today was from Acts chapter 2. It was after the day of Pentecost and it was the headed up the fellowship of believers. Remember the believers that were filled with the Spirit on Pentecost were a bunch of vagabonds really. Vagabonds. Now that's a word from the side of our hall in that song by Stuart Townend. Vagabonds. Don't belongs. Winners. Losers. People like me, travellers, questioners, the fallen, the broken, warriors, people with cares, people from every station and orientation, the hopeless, helpless, young and old, believers, dreamers, schemers, the restless, movers, shakers, givers, takers, the happy, the sad, the lost, the alone, the self-sufficient, those who feel at the end of the road, fiery debaters, religious haters, accusers, abusers, the hurt and the ignored. Some fishermen, some tax collectors, some sinners, the dregs of society, some would say. And yet God filled them with his Holy Spirit. And these were the founding fathers of the church. What beauty these weeds are displaying. Michel and I's vision of church is very much based around those verses in Acts chapter 2. There needs to be a real fellowship within the believers. There needs to be a desire to know more, a desire to be together, a desire to eat together, to share not only in a church building but in each other's homes, to share what we have. Sylvie brought us a song just before we look at script, scripture and it was he's my brother he's not heavy and the words of that is a, they're about brothers supporting each other carrying each other's burden and that's what the early church was about they shared the scriptures together they shared the food together. But when they saw that one was in need, 
They didn't leave that person in need. They shared the burden. They shared their possessions. They sold things so that they could give the money to others in need. There might be a bunch of weeds, might be a bunch of vagabonds, but when the Holy Spirit comes into the lives of men and women like these, like you and me, the beauty of God shines through. The glow of the sunshine, the glory of God shining on these flowers today is the same as the glory of God shining on his people. His people here in Poplar. We can shine, we can grow, we can be together in or out of our building. Let this be a time when we allow the Holy Spirit to have his way, to blow through us and bring out the beauty.